Blessed day beautiful people, I am Elie and welcome to my channel. Hi guys, today I have a really important and beautiful message that I really want to share with you guys. So before that, happy blessed Passover guys. Yes, Passover. And I will explain myself. This Sunday, April 4, 2021, we will celebrate Easter. But what is Easter? So according to Google, Easter is the most important Christian festival of the year. It's when Christians celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ. Since I was little and I was still living in Italy, I only knew that Easter was all about parties at churches, long programs, and chocolate eggs. But while growing up, I understood what we are celebrating right now. My parents taught me and explained to me what was the Passover. So if we read in Exodus chapter 12, in chapter 12 of Exodus, we can read that the Israelites had to put lamb blood on their doors so that the angel of that would not strike their families. And they obeyed and they were saved. The blood of the lamp, it was a sign for the angel of death to not enter. And that is the Passover in the Old Testament. But we also have a new Passover that is Jesus that died on the cross for us. And we can see that the lamp is Jesus. The blood of the lamp covered the doors so that the Israelites would be saved. And that is the same case. Jesus was the lamp and his blood is currently covering us so that the devil has no power on us. Indeed, the blood of Jesus is powerful. This is why when I normally pray, I say that we are all covered with the most precious blood of Jesus because the blood of Jesus protects us. We are currently celebrating the second Passover, not only the death of Jesus, but also his resurrection because he died and rose again for you and me. Like the Israelites, we need to obey, guys. We need to accept Jesus in our lives. We have to accept Jesus as our Lord and Savior in our lives. And we need to live according to what is written in the Word of God. When I was really little, like 8 years old, I always questioned myself. Like, why we are all doing these kind of celebrations, long programs? But when I grew up and then I met Jesus, encountered God, I realized that we must celebrate what Jesus did every single day. Not only in the spirit, but every day we must celebrate that Jesus died for me and he rose again for me. Just the thought that Jesus died and rose again for me. A sinner. I am just really so grateful and thankful. Like, why dying in such a cruel way? Before I was born, He knew me. Before I was born, He already loved me so much. And before I was born, He already prepared a wonderful life for me to live. We celebrate Holy Week not only to remember that Jesus died for us, but Jesus resurrected for us. He gave us hope. He is our hope. He is the way, the truth, and the life. If we are with Him, nothing is impossible. The more you get to know God, the more you will be overwhelmed by His love, like every single day. God deserves to be exalted every single day. He deserves the highest, the highest praises. We don't deserve salvation. We deserve to die because we are all sinners. All kind of sins make us sinners, like telling a lie or murder. They have the same weight in the eyes of God. Without God, we are only dust. In conclusion, please accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior. He is the way, the truth, and the life. Jesus is coming soon. We must be ready. We must be prepared at any time. Let us encourage one another to share the word of God, to do His will every day. Let us pray for one another. We need to share the word of God. We cannot just be selfish. We cannot be the only one enjoying the peace and love and joy that God is giving us every day. Everyone needs salvation. Everyone needs Jesus. Let us obey what is written in the Bible. 
Let's go and make disciples of all nations. Jesus is coming soon. We all need to repent and declare with our powerful mouth that Jesus is Lord and Savior over our lives. Guys, we need to pray more and more and more because all kinds of calamities, they are bound to happen. I've been quite busy these past few months, but God is good because He's still talking to me through dreams. God made me see that a lot of earthquakes, tsunami, they are bound to happen because these are the signs that Jesus is coming soon, that the end is near. I believe that if we grow closer to God, He will reveal so many things to us. <laughs> Lastly, again guys, we need to pray for one another because the devil, he is always busy and doing his best to destroy us. Guys, thank you so much for watching and again, happy blessed Holy Week. We must celebrate Jesus every day. Guys, remember, Jesus loves you. Like I always say, pray more, love more, Jesus more in your life. May God bless you.